I've never had a video that went up that high, like, it was insane. What's up everyone, my name is Anthony, also known as Captain Bidman on the internet. Uh, today, I am taking some inspiration from a YouTube friend of mine, her name is Stephanie Haynes, also known as SassFX on YouTube, go subscribe to her right now because she does amazing social effects makeup and everything. What it is is that she did a post where she was like, people were talking about 2016 being such a horrible year which, I mean I'm not going to lie, there was some stuff that we weren't prepared for like Alan Rickman dying and most recently Carrie Fisher and Debbie Reynolds like literally the day after each other. Anyway, so while we remember them, it's time to really kind of think of what's happened in 2016, particularly for me, because 2016 was a huge year. Like, it was unbelievable, like, I did so many things, crazy, I mean, you guys got to see some of the stuff that I did, um, some of the stuff that I didn't, I did do, but I did film vlogs, but I ne never really put it up on my channel. Um, so yeah, I thought we'd do a bit of a recap video of exactly what happened, what went down in 2016 because in the next couple of days it will be 2017 or if you are watching this in 2017, hello, how's the future? Let me know what it's like in the comments down below. So, let's get this started. Okay, so starting off with the beginning of 2016, around like January, in the January month, I put out, managed to put out two Lebanese culture videos, me and my mom making hummus. And another one where I kind of taught you guys how to speak Lebanese, it's sort of like an essential basic 101, which is something that went really well. So February was a big, it was sort of like a milestone for me uh, in terms of YouTube, is because, all right, first of all, I hit, uh, I hit 100 subscribers, which was big, okay? The first 100 you reach, well, the first 50 and 100 is like big, 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 big. Like, it's something that like, they say it's hard to get the first 100 subscribers, and my god, it was so hard. Anyway, so, <laughs> February came, I uploaded a reaction video to a new TV series that was never done before on Channel 9, it was called Here Come the Habibs. And so, that first episode, because how I do the videos, so I watched them on the Tuesday, and then I edited them and got them up on the Wednesday, so I was quick about getting my reactions up, because I wanted them to go really well. Anyways, <laughs> it's already been eight minutes of just me rambling. Uh, anyways, so the first video, it was about 200 views when I checked it, and then I don't know what happened, but that went up, 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 to the point where it's currently nearly at, at 8,000 views, okay? So coming from what, like February, which was the second month in the year, to now where it's the end, it's, it's a big thing, okay? It got 7,000, it got 7,000, how long did, how much did it go? Um, I think it got about 7,000 views within like the first week or so, which was big for me. Like, it, I, I've never had a video that went up that high. Like, it was insane. Um, I, I was so happy, like, I was checking it every time, and I was like, ah! Anyway, so, we've had that. So we had a whole series of the reactions, which season two is coming. Okay, season two is coming. Reaction videos are gonna be for season two, just to let you know. Oh. Uh, anyways, yes, so, did that, the March, we had, uh, I created my first short film, uh, it, and I mean short, like 50 seconds, okay, and I also went on a plane for the first time, and that was an, ex an experience in itself, like, I was on a plane, my friend Matt McKenna, also known as Bye Everybody on Twitter, and Matt McKenna on YouTube, um, he was with me on the day because I could take one person and I chose Matt. So he was the person who I chose to take with me because he had experience in this and plus I wanted him to come along for the ride and experience this with me. And so I made a short film which um, I will put a link to it, the YouTube video down below. Um, but yeah, that was insane. And then it came with April. My first job ended, like something I've been doing for two years had ended. I also got a diploma in business admin and everything, so it's turning out to be really big for me so far. Okay, and then when April, with this whole aftermath of like the film and everything, like 
it, it, I, I felt like a celebrity, okay? Because I was recognized twice. Like, it may not seem a bit like a big deal, but to me, it's like, if people can recognize you for the content you make, then, I mean, you've made it, okay? Anyway, so, April came, went, then we hit to May, which is when I was recognized even more for the short film I made. I won the Australian Lebanese, I was one of the recipients of the Arts and Culture Awards for the Australian Lebanese Foundation. I met one of my favorite people of all time, Lillian. She just started her YouTube channel, so you should go check it out. Link will be down below. And she did an amazing video of her doing The Grinch, which she only just released like a couple of days ago, so go check that out as well. Anyways, um, it's all that promo, like promo love for everyone. So, yep, I finished, uh, I did that, and then after that, I went to Supernova Sydney. Now, this was the first convention I've ever been to, like, I mean, EB Games Expo was technically the first one, but, I mean, in terms of, like, a convention convention for, like, comic book and pop culture, Supernova was the first one, and I met, like, one of, like, childhood, childhood dreams came true in that day, because I met the cast of Charmed, I met, uh, Brian Cross, Holly Marie Combs, and Shannon Doherty, who are, like, all-time, like, favourite childhood is literally coming true, being made, and I also found out of an opportunity where I can be a superhero. Which brings us up to July. I made a superhero film with the team at Action Reaction Entertainment, or now the yeah, Action Reaction Entertainment, or they've changed it. Um, I did that. If you want to check out the video, I'll put a link down below as well to the Facebook post where I did it. Um, we did that, and then. I made my short, I made my Captain America film, and then that kind of got me into doing cosplay, which I will talk about later on. But July comes, I actually started a new job after that, and doing something that I really love. And I mean, the place where I work, I mean, I, I'm so happy to be working there. Like I, I I'm genuinely happy because if you see this, this is like, I'm doing something that I really love. And I get to do so much more stuff, like content, like, I can't, like, I'm, I, can't, I can't fathom how lucky I am to be working in a place that has such good people, the environment is amazing, people accept you for who you are, they love you for doing, like, I'm big on the superheroes, uh, I actually got two cosplay costumes, I got my Captain America suit, which you would have seen in the video I put up of me singing <laughs> uh, a, karaoke, a karaoke version of a very like old, old song. So I did that and I also got a Hawkeye costume which I got more in September in September for Oz Comic Con. And yeah, then I also traveled to Queensland for the first time for work um, and I got to meet some YouTube friends of mine, Taylor Talk and Logan Skinner and Rosie Neverland so you should go check them out. And I also got to just like absorb it and kind of like experience that. And then in August, because we're now up to August, I turned 21. Now this like, okay, so 21 is sort of like a big thing. So in Australian culture, you have your 18th, well, in all types of culture, you have your 18th, your 21st, and then, and then so forth and so forth. So I turned 21 and I got celebrated in style with my friends and some of my family, uh, and uh, family friends as well. And then I went to Us Comic Con, which was amazing. Like, when you dress up, you're always gonna get after pictures. So I got like some really awesome pictures. Check them out on my social media. Uh, I, I mentioned social media a lot, and it's because I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys, okay? Social media is a way for promoting uh, content that you make, whether it be on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, it's all about promotion. And that happened, then we come to October. That was, uh, I did some filming for Ubisoft and I got to go to the, EB Games, to the EB Games Expo. And then you come to November, which was uh, a big thing for me as well. I hit, uh, I hit 200 subscribers. Yeah, and then in December, cause we're currently in December right now. So, I went to my first movie premiere to Star Wars Rogue One and let me tell you guys it's the most amazing movie ever, okay? Like it's the best Star Wars movie ever since the original trilogy. 
And so I got to do that with my best mate Jaden and also my friend Gemma who she got to enjoy so you go check out her vlog I also did a vlog there so you should go check that out as well and then I made this now if you can see it's Captain Fizzman right there and so um, I made a doll of me and then you have Christmas which I could celebrate with family and then we come to today which is the um, December 20 December 30th uh, and yeah, so um, that's it for uh, 2016. It was a massive, massive recap. Like, so many things happened. So, I mean, I do agree that 2016 was a bit horrible. We had Trump being elected, we had uh, Alan Rickman dying, David Bowie, George Michael, so many celebrity deaths. Um, and yeah, but I mean, I will say for me personally, it was a big year for me, and so much things have happened. So, yeah. Here's to 2017, so many more things are happening like VidCon, both LA and Australia, the first time VidCon Australia is happening, that's going to be exciting. Uh, we have a meetup happening in the next couple of weeks, so I'll be sure to vlog that. Uh, so much is happening and I can't wait to share with you all. So from me, Captain Fizzman, have a great year and I'll see you guys, have a great new year and I'll see you guys in 2017. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give this a big thumbs up. Come down below what your what the highlight of your 2016 was and as always i'll see you guys next time peace out i love you guys all the way to the end and goodbye